God's kingdom is not bound by culture or language or location or time. God is the master of all space and all time. He created the universe. He ultimately will remake the universe. That's the God that we serve. The God that cannot just move mountains. The God that can move universes. That's the God we serve. And we saw it in Jesus' life. He was the Lord of the waves. He was the Lord of the storms. He walked on water. And he still does today. He's still interceding for his people. His love and grace still keep us going today. It's not by strength. It's not by might. It's not by power. But by my spirit, says the Lord, according to the prophets at the right. We seek spiritual applications. Matthew Henry has a good word on this. Christ taught them to pray in faith. It may be applied that mighty faith, which is true to all Christians, are in doubt, and which does wonders in spiritual things. It justifies us, and so it removes mountains of guilt, never to rise in judgment against us. It purifies the heart, and so removes mountains of corruption, and makes them plain before the grace of God. And prayer, by the way, is a conversation. We not only speak to God, God moves our hearts and our minds. And so does the Spirit. In prayer, it's not as important as what we think. It's more important what God 